Alright guys, uh, this video, um, I made this video to show um, how to repair MSD ignition system. Um, this is what they look like right here. And uh, sometimes they go bad. I don't know why, but uh, sometimes they do, and I think it's due to inefficient cooling or heat transfer from the uh, voltage regulators and transistors down inside there. The one that I replaced is actually right, not the first one, but the next one over was fried, and that in turn fried the suppressor diode, which is right there you can see the burn marks and shit down in there it's pretty nasty um here's part of the old one uh here's the other part of it uh it's a 6000 watt suppressor diode uh really hard to find and it goes together like that basically so that's how I have the other one installed. I've actually got a 5,000 watt in there now. And then this is the transistor that fried out. You can see one of the legs is completely fried, gone. And I got, um, I was able to find the number on there. Uh, using the microscope I got over there, luckily. I was able to read the partial numbers and get the correct number. Um, also on the diode, I was able to find the model on that too. Um, so this is basically after I changed the thermal compound underneath the transistors and the heat block, or the heat sink and everything, and um, put it back together and um, running 12 volts in this is the uh, ignition uh, sensor wire here so I'm hardwiring that to the 12 volt and then this is the hard 12 volt right here and then here's the ground and then this is my magnetic pickup uh, the magnetic pickup uh, sensor here that will go into the magnetic pickup and then uh, here is the coil wire right here this is a red and black or orange and black for the coil as you can see hooked up right there and I've got uh, the power goes in to the primary coil and comes out secondary high voltage which is being shorted back to ground for the test mode um, I ran a regular 12 volts from the variable DC power supply that I have here um, but this is only 2 amp right here wasn't enough power to trip the, the uh, 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 relay over so what I did was I paired up in parallel to build up amps, my other uh, 3 amp 12 volt power supply and I've got it hooked up in parallel running dual uh, wires right over here and into the configuration I just showed and when Basically, I'm doing the test like they they explain in the manual, um, except I don't have the thing hooked up to a car battery in a car. You know, I'm basically bypassing all of that junk, and I'm down to the test phase where I short out the um, magnetic uh, pickup. So. When I touch this into the uh, plug right there, you should see the coil spark.
So every time I move the thing back and forth, you can see it spark. It's kind of hard to do with one hand, but... But any time this shorts out, it sends a little spark. So that appears to be uh, functioning properly now. And um, every time I do that, I can hear the, um, oh, man, I'm tied to the wall with a cord here with my f camera, sorry. Um, anytime I do this spark, I hear a little bit of a hum in the the uh, power supply here it thumps a little bit because it's dishing out a decent amount of amps real quick like that right off right out the gate and uh <clears throat> but it's only pulsed it's just a pulse dc uh, high voltage dc and uh so, yeah, I'm going to be taking it over and testing it in the vehicle today um, and see if it uh, see if it fires up. That'd be cool. Uh, then I know there's a lot of guys out there complaining about the MSD going bad. This definitely appears to be working. Yeah, so. Anyways, yeah, I checked for heat and everything in there. I've been sparking this thing for a while and there's no heat. Um, so what he's probably going to end up doing, I'm going to have him do is install a thing uh on the other side of the firewall where there's not as much heat and keep it out of the out of the um the engine bay where the heat builds up anyways yeah so if you have any questions just send me a comment and i'll do my best to try and help thank you bye